All right, y'all. Like always, I'm just finna give y'all some food for thought, and y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. I'm gonna read y'all something. Y'all can follow along. Y'all can read ahead, but let's do it together. It states, David Blaine and Chris Rock. David Blaine's only previously known connection to Epstein was appearing in his black book of contact, but the two men appear to have had a relationship, the record suggests. In June 2013, Epstein had a dinner with the futurist Pablo's Holman and a Jessica Jofe, which appears to be the actress of the same name. The schedule says David Blaine will stop by toward the end of dinner. Reached by phone, Holman said he thought he was in San Francisco at the time of the dinner, but said, I don't know exactly. He said that he knew Blaine called Epstein the most toxic thing in the whole world. Not only that, Holman said, even if there was a dinner, I probably wouldn't want to say anything about it. Not only that, Joff did not return calls for comment. Neither did her representatives. We get into the good stuff, y'all. It says in September 2013, Blaine attended another dinner at Epstein's house with Woody Allen, Jeff Coons, and his wife, Justine, the record show. Then in January 2014, Epstein planned another dinner with his friends, including his girlfriend, a young Eastern European called Kanara Shukli, Woody Allen, and Jess Staley. Blaine was also listed among those attending, and the schedule says that Sarah and Brian would stop by, Sarah being Sarah Keelan, one of Epstein's top recruiters. The calendar also says that maybe Chris Rock would be coming. The first time that comedian has been linked to Epstein. In 2002, Epstein did invite another comedian, Chris Tucker, on a trip to Africa with former President Bill Clinton aboard Epstein's private jet. Now I must ask, Chris Tucker, what you doing over in Africa on Epstein's plane with Bill Clinton? Mm -mm -mm. We got some digging to do, y'all. With that being said, we're going to continue. A source close to Rock said that he did not attend the dinner. The source admitted that Rock was friendly with Woody Allen. The comedian has previously said he has watched the director's movie, Anna Hall, more than 80 times, but that Epstein may have confused him with Tucker. On April 4th, 2014, Epstein calendar said, Reminder, David Blaine's birthday is April 4th. Now, with that being said, we now know that David Blaine, the fake magic magician is part of this piece of theory not only that it makes me think y'all remember when chris tucker told us that he would no longer continue any friday movies because he has seen too much and that he's transferring his life over to god it makes me think what did he really see that was so bad not only that you got some explaining to do why you was over in Africa with Bill Clinton, who him and his wife are both linked to bringing kids across the border from third world countries. Did y'all forget about Laura Celisby in the Haiti situation and her bringing 33 unknown, undocumented kids, or at least trying to, across the border? With that being said, we ain't gonna do too much. This that soul food. And if you didn't know, now you know, Niji. So with that being said, make sure y'all hit that like, share, and comment button. But before you go could it be that chris tucker is one of the individuals that has not been to this epstein island not only that do y'all think that chris rock has to go through these certain humiliation rituals in order for him to continue to stay at the top we ain't gonna forget about what will smith did at the oscars i already know he hit that man so hard i think i heard his ancestors speak for him with that being said y'all already understand clear eyes always recognize real lives and like always i'm always gonna have more videos as i always like to express in all my other videos i am not here to turn non-believers into believers I'm only here to bring y'all food for thought. And with that being said, your opinion is your opinion. That way, that part. Why Michael and I also want to acknowledge. Uh... I mean, this dude is a genius.